Bachelorette star Michelle Young hasn't held back prompting honest conversations on important topics this season, and she's encouraging her contestants to follow suit. Tuesday's episode of the reality dating show featured a candid conversation between Michelle and Joe, a fellow Minnesota native and former basketball player, who opens up about the intense mental health struggles, including thoughts of suicide, he faced after an injury ended his basketball career. It was beyond difficult. It was anxiety, depression, there were times when I was thinking I didn't even want to still be here, Joe says. Ball was life, and that life was gone. An 11th hour accusation threatens Michelle's frontrunner. Through tears. Joe explains that a foot injury and subsequent surgery complications meant that he wasn't going to be able to continue playing basketball on a competitive level. I've always had such high standards, and I didn't feel like I was still there, he says. It was just breaking me down too much that I knew mentally I wasn't in a good place. I knew it probably was time to wrap it up and focus on what can make me happy outside of basketball. So much of your identity is wrapped up in sports that you're like, who am I at this point? Michelle also a former basketball player, empathizes with Joe having to cope with losing something so central to his identity. That's a pain not everyone will understand, she says. You woke up fighting every day, in, a battle that a lot of people didn't know about. Hollywood has a sordid history with portrayals of mental illness. It's trying to do better. The segment began with a content warning and ended with suicide hotline information, both increasingly prevalent in entertainment as Hollywood pushes to improve the way it depicts mental illness. This isn't the first time Michelle and her contestants have tackled heavy topics on ABC's reality show. Earlier this season, they've had conversations about racism, mental health and grief. The Bachelorette recap, Michelle opens up about being called a racial slur. Who went home? Chris, who continues the drama he sparked last week among the men, gets the boot early on after crashing Michelle and Knight's one-on-one -on -one date. But Knight gets that rose, as does Joe on their one-on-one, -on -one, and Clayton collects the group date rose. That leaves Rick, Olu. Brandon, Martin and Rodney to receive flowers at the rose ceremony, while Michelle says goodbye to Casey and Leroy. What will it take to fix the Bachelor franchise's racism? If you or someone you know may be struggling with suicidal thoughts, you can call the U.S. National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 800-273-TALK, 8255, any time day or night, or chat online. Crisis Text Line also provides free, 24-7 confidential support via text message to people in crisis when they dial 741741.
The American Foundation for Suicide Prevention has resources to help if you need to find support for yourself or a loved one.